Hello all movie zoomers and everybody out there. Here's the first thing we're going to do. Um, I'm in Microsoft Picture at 10 um, if you have another editing program. First thing you want to do is you want to open up a new photo. I'm going to teach you this really cool trick. Um, you need a blank thing. You're going to go to uh, Format. Um, we're going to resize to Canvas so we go Custom Resize. If you have this program it's great. It's free. So what we're going to do is um, we're going to resize. Um, instead of inches you want to go to your pixels. It's called PXL. Now what we want to do is we want to resize this to 2730. Make sure it's on both of them. Okay. Once you get that done um, you're going to bring in a photo of yourself, just a little photo of yourself. I already have one done so I can show you what that looks like. Okay, so what I did here is I've got a photo of myself and as you see it's just off the screen just a little bit. I didn't soften it or anything like that. I just went ahead and cut out a quick picture of myself and I just kind of plopped it right there. Now what we want to do is you want to file save as, I put it on my desktop, you want to save it as .png. Go ahead and do that and then we're going to save it and then don't care if it's flat, just save it on your desktop as a .png and then uh, we'll come back. Okay, so the next thing we want to do here is create a character in MovieZoo. Alright, you got your character created, we're just going to just click create character. Uh, MovieZoo Plus, remember, for import. Now we got our character, we're going to double click our character couple steps we have to do before we do our import. The very first thing we have to do is come down to where it says face. Um, we want to make sure he has no eyebrows, so we click brows, none. Make sure he has no eyes, so we click on eyes, none. Um, nose, make sure he has no o nose, nose, none. Same with ears. We want to basically make sure the only thing that he's got is a mouth. Okay, because remember your face is going over top of this. Um, so. Do, 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 do. Waiting. Okay. Now we're going to go back to his hair. We're going to go ahead and take out his hair because we want to make sure that it's going to be even. If by some chance you go to import this and it doesn't look right, you just go ahead and go back and, you know, you just adjust it a little bit, save it, and then just re import it. Okay. Now we're going to click over here on decals. We click decals, custom texture. Click here. Down on the bottom, you click import. And I remember I saved mine on my desktop. So wherever you saved your file. Mine's on my desktop, so we'll go back to my desktop, and I called it me. PNG file, double click. Okay, it's compressing the texture file. And there's my, my photo. It brings it right in perfectly. So now we go ahead and close. Close that. And we can go back to appearance now, and we can add some cool features. And now you can go ahead and adjust your character anyway. You can put stuff on them. Um, or whatever you want. I thought this was a really cool feature. I was messing around with building some more custom textures and stuff. And uh, I said, well, why can't I bring in my own face on a character? And so that's exactly what I did. And I hope you guys enjoy this and um, use it. Oh, and by the way, just really quick, I can show you. Um, I'm going to prepare some audio real quick. Just show you that he does talk. So um, let me go ahead and prepare that. I'm going to stop this real quick. And um, when I come back, you'll see. Okay, we're back. I just had to import some audio super quick. So now what I'm doing is I'm going to Tools, Timeline, I'm going to show you. I just imported some quick audio. It may lag a little, but um, you'll get the generalized idea that he can talk. So now you can bring in not only just your face, but you can make him talk. You can also do whatever you want with your character. Um, and now bring in your own face. You can also throw eyes on top, nose, ears on top of your own face as well. So it's not like you're limited to doing a bunch of stuff. Um, so give me one second and I'll show you that too. Alright, so like what I was saying with the eyes. So like um, if we come down here to double click on your character, you click your eyes. You can also throw some eyes on top of your character. See, so like if you want your character to be able to blink and stuff, you can throw some eyes on them. Um, you can also throw some brows on them. Um, if you want. I guess you can do pretty much everything is still the same. Um, so you can still reanimate by reanimating. Um, it's a lot of fun. So have fun with MovieZoo and um, keep creating and hope this helps.